Hey guys, Red Rappers here, and today I'm going to show you how you can remove Amazon apps from an Amazon Fire tablet. So at the minute, as you can see, we have apps such as Amazon Kids and Amazon Games. So if we wanted to uninstall them, if we tried like we normally would with any other app, so if we hold on it, as you can see, the uninstall option is grayed out. So instead to remove them, we're going to be using a tool called Fire Toolbox. So what we're going to be doing is we're going to be connecting our tablet to the computer and then using that to remove them from the tablet. So to do that, we're going to need to enable USB debugging. And to be able to enable USB debugging, we're going to need to turn on developer options. So to turn on developer options, you want to come to your settings. And then in your settings, you want to come down to device options. Then you want to press on about your Fire tablet. And then you want to tap on these serial numbers seven times. So if we come back, as you can see, we now have the developer options. So if we come into developer options and we turn the developer options on, and we press OK. And then we come down to USB debugging and we turn that on and we press OK. We now have USB debugging enabled. So now we can close our settings and now we can come over to the computer. So if you come to this link here, the link will be in the description. This is where you can download the Fire Toolbox from. So if we scroll down to the download section and we download the EXE installer. And then if it comes up saying that it may be dangerous, we will just click the up arrow here and we will click keep. And then we will open the installer up. And if smart screen comes up, we're going to click more information and then we will click run anyway. And then I will select install for all users. And then we will just go through the installation wizard. And then we'll click finish and it should then launch the tool. So now we're going to connect our tablet to our computer. So here I have a USB-A to USB-C cable. So obviously the USB-C cable end will plug into the tablet and the USB-A end will plug into the computer. So if I just plug that in, and now we've got that plugged in, it will now come up asking us to allow USB debugging. So I'm going to select always allow from this computer and then I will press OK. And there we go, we should now have established a connection through USB debugging to the computer. So now we're going to come back to the computer. Now we're not going to go through the start tour, instead we're going to click the theme option here. And then you want to select whatever theme you want, I prefer the blue one. And then we're just going to close this window. And then I will click OK to that prompt and close this other window. And now to uninstall the Amazon apps, we're going to select the Manage Amazon Apps option here. And then we're going to come down to the Manual section here, and we're going to check the Simple Recommended box here. So now this will give us a list of all the apps that we can remove. And with the colour coding, you can see what effect uninstalling the app will do. So a green app indicates it's an app that is safe to disable. And then a yellow app is an app that you can replace the functionality with with a third party. As long as you have another app to provide that function or you're not bothered about a function, you can uninstall it. And then a red one is one that could cause you other problems that can't be fixed. Now you can uninstall them if you want. You can decide just by reading what will happen if you do. So I'm just going to go through the list and select the apps that I want to remove. So now as you can see, I've selected all the apps that I want to try to remove. Now it's unlikely that it's going to be able to remove all of them as I'm not even sure if I have all of them on this tablet but it will do its best to remove them. So once you've selected all the apps that you want to remove, we will then just click Disable Selected. And as you can see, it was unable to disable three of them. So if you come to the console, you can then see which of the apps it failed to remove. And now if we come back to the tablet, and as you can see, we no longer have the apps, so there's no Amazon Kids, and there's no Amazon Games, so the apps that we selected were disabled. So guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you liked it, don't forget the like button. If you disliked it, hit the dislike button. Subscribe for more content like this, and I'll see you another time. Bye.